Well, Gregory Watelet now of Belgium, Stefik Stables, Egano van Hes, Slugenhoff for the uh, Belgian rider. He's had one of his best years as well, including winning uh, silver in Arken individually in the European Championships, one of the Chanty Grand Prix. He's pushed him right up there in the Longines World Rankings. Dan yet, yet another fantastic rider. Yeah, I was going to say another rider's rider, really. Well, this guy is, can ride anything from us, he is a genius. And again, if he can keep this up, he is fast. And he scampers around the corner. Covers that quickly. This is looking good. Very good, very good. If we can, if we can stay clean, oh, that's a huge risk. Totally fantastic. And he's getting a little empty. Oh! A lot of time here. There we go. Look at that wow. for a time. 58-18, it was faster. Two seconds to add, still puts him in the lead. 60.18, Gregory Watale. Yeah, again, a, like, a wonderful ride there. You can see the horse was getting a little empty there the last yeah. three or four jumps. But still, because he was so fast, he's still going into the lead anyway with, with that one fault. And that, and that last but one fence, as you're talking about there, I mean, you, you turn up tight to it, and you need a big push over that, don't you? Think? Exactly, a big push, and, and the horse was so empty, he, he jumped it in front, and unfortunately wasn't just able to get the, the back legs over. A great effort there, though, that was yeah. fantastic. It's enough to go in the lead. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Either way, doesn't matter how you do it. 58 AC would have been otherwise.